Welcome everyone, today's video is just a quick guide on how to get set up on Solano so you can start buying meme coins and other things that you're seeing uh, popping off on Twitter and the like. So for you to actually get started with Solano, you're going to have to download uh, a wallet so you can interact with the blockchain. So the popular choices are Backpack and Phantom and I'll leave a link in the description down below uh, to both of these wallets these are the um, I, I would say the most popular ones and I personally am a big fan of Phantom uh, I recommend that you go to their Twitters first and then go to the links that they have in their Twitter description and that'll make sure that you don't go to any do dodgy websites that may pop up on Google because if you do that then you're putting yourself um, at risk so go to phantom.app I'm showing you Phantom for today and you'll have to download Phantom and then once you're there you have to create a new wallet and then you'll be given a uh, seed phrase. Make sure you don't share anyone that seed phrase, write it down somewhere, keep it safe because that's how you're able to actually access those funds and if someone else gets a hold of them, they'll be able to steal it. So once you've got that all up and running, it should be a fairly quick process. If you're familiar with like say MetaMask, for example, then you'll be familiar with Phantom. Um, I would say using Phantom and Solana is a lot easier than using MetaMask. Uh, a lot less, uh, I feel like, could go wrong. And they also simulate the transactions for you, which is quite nice. And so once you've got that up and running, you're going to need to send some Sol uh, over to your wallet. And once you've sent that Sol into the wallet, obviously you can uh, send over some USDC or some other uh, currency that you might want to use on Solana. Do you need a bit of Sol in your wallet? Um, you know, bring one Sol or like 0.0. Five or something like that you you will need a little bit more than expected although Solana transactions are cheap you're going to have to pay for uh, token storage so if you want to bridge over to Solana from um, any EVM chain you can go to dupe.ag forward slash bridge compare I'll leave a link in the description down below for this um, and this will take you to uh, this screen and then say if you wanted to move 100 USDC from Arbitrum to Solana this will show you uh, you, that you can use Allbridge Core or Dbridge to do this and then you can just click on these links and it'll take you to another website and where you'll be prompted to go ahead and start bridging some money over. So of course uh, you have Ethereum, Optimism, BNB, uh, Polygon, Base, uh, Avalanche, Linear and Tron all different places that you can bridge over to from Solana. So this is probably the best place to go for actually trading um, any sort of Solana coin out there because this is an aggregator it will give you the best prices as it aggregates all of the price credits from all the various different um, AMMs and other DEXs out here uh, on Solana so for example you can choose to trade USDC to Pyth um, to Stake Sol to Render to Samo uh, Crown basically every token that you want to think of trading you can trade it here um, and it's actually quite easy to use, um, you know, very, very reminiscent of like Uniswap on one inch and that sort of thing. And the fees are quite cheap here uh, as well. More things that you can do with Jupyter Aggregator is you can set limit orders um, and dollar cost average if you want to as well. So it's actually pretty advanced in terms of like um, aggregators out there. And uh, I quite like it. I've been using this for like two years now. So I'm a big fan of Jupyter Aggregator. And then also I wanted to talk about Step Finance. So Step Finance, will, once you connect to it with your wallet or you can uh, put in any Solana address, for example, it'll start giving you stats, uh, previous transactions, and it'll show you all the NFTs that you have here as well, uh, where you're farming, so on and so forth. So this could be uh, a valuable tool uh, to use. Now, when you actually want to go about actually trading meme coins, you might see something uh, popping off on Twitter, for example, or someone recommends you take a look at a coin, then you can go to birdeye.so, type in whatever token you want, and it will actually give you charts. Um, buying meme coins, I mean, you know, it will help that you actually like monitor the price a lot because oftentimes uh, these things will actually rug. Um, but let's just say, for example, we, we want to take a look at Bonk, which is quite popular right now. It's had a I want to say like a thousand percent rise in the like the last 30 days uh well you know something close to that it's doing really well um and so you can see it here and if you wanted to you can connect your wallet here directly you don't have to go to jupiter aggregator i mean it's still powered by jupiter but you can swap through here and it's quite easy 
Um, you can go into the trending tab, see what's going on. Uh, Rocky, Raj, Pyth, uh, Crown, uh, find gems, that sort of thing. And so this is the place you want to go if you want to chart uh, random Solana coins. Last thing I wanted to talk about today is SolScan, which is the block explorer for Solana. Um, it's quite nice because it just shows you, um, you know, like what's popping off. Like it's quite nice. It shows you what's popular. You can look up different transactions that are going on, your own transactions, see what's happening with them. They're very own DeFi uh, dashboard here, as well as as well as an NFT dashboard. You can see what's popular uh, and so on and so forth. And so this might be a quite a useful tool for you as well. So if you wanted to see what centralized exchanges you can actually buy Solana from, you can go into CoinGecko.com, find Solana. We want to go to markets and this will show you all the different centralized exchanges where you can buy at Solana from and then send that to your wallet. So we have, you know, like a Binance, a Coinbase, Kraken, uh, Bybit, Gate, that sort of thing. So thank you for watching. I hope you enjoyed this video and make sure to subscribe for more videos like this one.